Hello and welcome back to Soma Diecast and welcome back to another random restoration Monday. And today we have the Hot Wheels Hijackers or High Rakers, excuse me, High Rakers Vet Van. Last time I did one of these, it had the top caved in and we had to do a lot of work. This one is well played with, but not bad in, in uh, all the way around. Tampos are gone, but that saves me a little work. So let's go ahead and get this thing blown apart, see what we got to play with, and see what we can do to clean it up. Everybody stick around. All right, we got our little 1979 vet van all blown apart. And if you look at the front here just a little bit, you can see it's a little wonky. And this pillar's bent. And this one is in pretty good shape. At the top, and you can see it's got a little wave in it. But it's already cracked here and here. So we're going to try to straighten that out as best we can without completely snapping everything apart. And, com well... To be honest, compared to the first one I did, when the front was caved in, this shouldn't be too terrible, he said. Anyway, it has one post. I already drilled it and tapped it for a 172 screw here in the front. Yeah, top's going to be fun. And we have a nice smoked glass, which is pretty rough, but that should clean up pretty good. A little light sanding and polishing. And that beautiful whatever color that is, kind of a saddle looking or a khaki color. <laughs> we have a jack and a gas can and a battery and two, two toolboxes and a big old engine in the back. And a metal base. Got the black wall wheels on it, which we're gonna leave those on there and try to polish around them as much as possible. And then we'll freshen up the wheels. And then we have our high raker unit back here in the back. Goes in here. It's always fun to put these back together. Put that in there. This snaps up inside there. And we'll be all set. We'll get it all cleaned up, prettied up, and then we'll see what we can do with that body. But in the meantime, let's go ahead and get the body stripped and get the rest of it cleaned up. And I got to get busy making some decals because this is going to be the red variation. I already have the black one. I'm going to do the red one. So, everybody, stick around.
All right, before we get to the reveal, here is a quick look back at where we started. This is the Hot Wheels Vet Van, the High Raker version. It's a little play worn, and tampos are all worn away, so somebody loved it a lot. So let's go ahead and get to the reveal and see how this little car came out. So everybody, please stick around. Well, we have our little Hot Wheels vet, vet van from 1979, Blackwall, and it's the High Raker. This was a project I wanted to do ever since I found out there was a red variation in the vet van. I had done a restoration on a uh, vet van that was had the roof crashed in on it, and we got that all straightened out. This one had problems of its own. It had uh, a little bit of a wobble in the uh, in the roof, and also both of the A pillars were cracked right at the uh, little sunroofs on the top. But we managed to get that taken care of, and we tore it down the rest of the way, cleaned it up, and painted it in the uh, color shot stiletto, gloss stiletto, which is a beautiful, brilliant red. And then I uh, got in my uh, Adobe Illustrator and created a set of original style decals for it, which came out looking really nice. Got those applied, and we refurbished the wheels, cleaned up the base, and cleaned and polished the glass, and here it is, all finished up and ready to be displayed with its sister, <laughs> the black version. So, uh, I hope you like this video, and I hope you like this car. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up, and if you're not currently a subscriber, I hope you will. And ring the bell when you subscribe so you'll be notified of future vid videos when they're available, and be sure you share with your friends. Now, this was a fun little build, and I'm glad I got it uh, taken care of, and it looks beautiful, and I'm going to put it on my shelf and enjoy it. Well, this is another in a long line of restorations on my Random Restoration Mondays, and I hope you enjoy them as much as I do creating them. And uh, I will see you in the next.